Hey yo, what's going on guys, back with another brand new video. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about the Intel Iris Xe graphics, which came after the Intel UHD graphics. So people are saying this GPU is fast, this GPU can run games. So I'm going to be telling you that you need to buy a laptop or not, which has this graphics. So basically this graphics card, I mean, this is, I'm going to uh, show you the like uh, GPU. I have the install the tech power GPU Z. I'm going to show you the all specs of this GPU that I have right now, right here. So I'm going to be telling you if you need to buy this or not, or it will, if you if, like, especially if you're thinking to buy this for gaming. So I'm going to tell you like if you have to buy this or not. So as you can see, I have Intel Iris Xe graphics and then I have a like DDR memory type is DDR4 and a 128 bit of a, a bus width. So this can support like a 12, 12 plus one. And um, as you can see all the specs that like the uh, uh, GPU clock speed is 400 megahertz. So this GPU is actually integrated and it has a whopping four gigabyte of uh, pre-installed like memory. So, so if you don't, know what I'm talking about let me show you just real quick what I'm talking about so if I go to my task manager and then go to my performance so uh, as you can see right here CPU I mean sorry uh, the GPU so as you can see it has a 3.9 gigabyte of memory which which means like it basically have the 4 gigabyte memory pre-installed and it, it is not taking my RAM so it has a 4 gigabyte of uh, like um, uh, memory in it so if you're thinking that it has a 4 gigabytes of RAM and it, it is a DDR4 128 bit so it can run uh, games pretty smoothly like the 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 most played games pretty smoothly uh, the answer to that question is no it cannot so as you can see I have a CSGO and I uh, and I've tried some more games on it and uh, it, I tried like um, GTA 5 CSGO Dishonored 2 and all of them I tested and I got literally like 20 to 30 FPS so if you're thinking to buy this uh, buy this like um, um, graphics card for like gaming or like uh, it is fast uh, that, that is no like uh, question it is fast but it is not good for gaming so I've tried some uh, games that I don't get ma uh, many FPS like uh, depending like thinking about the uh, memory of it like it has a four gigabytes of uh, memory and it cannot run games pretty smoothly so I have a uh, by the way I have a, uh, a laptop called Lenovo IdeaPad L315 so it has a Core i7 11th generation pretty fast and uh, then it has Intel Iris Xe graphics so uh, this is not a gaming laptop but for work for work use it is a beast like it is so fast the, uh, it is a fast laptop that's what I'm saying so if you're thinking to buy this laptop for gaming just don't buy it this is not worth it like you can get a so uh, like um, uh, the, the laptop in which there is a Intel Iris Xe graphics uh, like it costs like 500 to 600 bucks so you can buy a uh, average gaming PC for that if you want to game on it like you can even record so I, I can play games I can record just uh, small games like Brawlhalla and everything like there are small games that like don't cause that much GPU speed or GPU clock speed anything I can run that game smoothly and they work and, uh, and I can record too but for some reason the CSGO and Dishonored 2 and GTA 5 type of games they don't run on this um, graphics card I mean this is not a graphic card this is an integrated graphics card but there is it is not good for the point is it is not good for gaming so if you're planning to buy this buy this li like a laptop in which there is a Intel Iris Xe graphics in it so don't buy it just just don't just look for something else just look for like um, if you want to um, yeah if you if you want to work like office work or do editing and stuff it is good for editing yeah I do my edits and everything it is good for editing it is good for everything else but gaming so you cannot game on it like you cannot play hi-fi um, games on this graphics card so yeah th that was the video if you like the video make sure you subscribe to my channel comment down below like the video and uh, hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video yeah bye bye